o'clock. It's more like a pneumatic drill. Can't you put it under the pillow or something? Well, why would I want to do that? Well, it's so loud. Well, it's supposed to be loud. It's an alarm clock. Bianca, come on, you're going to be late. All right, we'll be getting along, will you? It's going to be easier to try and sleep in the middle of major road work. Bianca! I'm coming! Take it she's feeling better, then. Yeah, she's feeling a lot better, thanks. First good night's sleep we've had for ages. Bianca! Great. Fancy some breakfast? I'm eating it. I'm eating a cooked breakfast. No, thank you. You're still mad at me. Am I? Definitely. You say so? Look, I don't like her being here any more than you do. Well, then tell her to leave. I can't chuck her out, can I? No, I don't seem to be. And what about Sarah? Mum being here means a lot to her right now. She won't be here forever. No, Mum, she'll get bored and disappear again. We'll get through it, I promise. Morning, boys. Morning. I'm off. Was it something I said? I've got to go to work. I hope it goes all right later on with your dad, yeah? No, oh, thanks. See ya. Bye. I wish he wouldn't do that. What? That. In public. What's public about his own kitchen? Your friend don't like me being here. His name's Simon and he's just worried about his dad, that's all. Right. He's in hospital, got pancreatitis or something. Oh, poor man. Serves him right, he's a waste of space. Oh, I quite liked him. What about you? Any plans for today? Not really. Mm. Not seeing that nice girl again, then? Polly? Mm. Very attractive, I thought. Really? Morning, darling. Morning. See the sugar toe? Mm. You don't want sugar on your cereal. Yes, I do. Gotta stop thinking about the old town. Here it is. Yeah, well, I think there's more important things to worry about, don't we? Suit yourself, but if I had someone like young Joe after me... Where's your friend, Mum? He's a very good-looking young boy. And I want you having a good time tonight. What for? Joe's coming for supper. Yeah, I know, but... I'm you're working... growing up and you've got to make the best of yourself, haven't you, Tony? I mean, what's he ever done for you, eh? It's not... Just a... say it was you in hospital now. Do you reckon he'd be making the effort to come visiting you? Grant, it's not that simple. If he dies, <sighs> I don't go and see him. He ain't gonna die. I've got to be able to live with myself. I'll get it. Right, right, keep your hair on. 